Shanti back with another video. If you are new, welcome to my channel. And as some of you guys know, well, by clicking on this video, you can get, you guys can tell that I plan on doing a home birth unassisted. So I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I have for right now. I still have to get a few more things, but you honestly, you don't need that much, you know, to have a baby at home. You know what I'm saying? So, um... I have a few things that I have ordered that, that truck is so loud. I have a few things that I have ordered that didn't come in yet, but I'm going to let you guys know what that is. But, um, okay, so I ordered this first. This is a weight, a baby scale. I ordered this first, but I was kind of like, I was kind of like iffy on it because I'm like, what if it, it don't really say the right exact you know wait for the baby because i guess it's like an extra digit on there and i didn't really know how to how to um how to tell pounds and ounces like you can do um what is it let me see did i put the batteries in there okay you can do kg ounces and pounds but it's not it don't say it don't say pounds and ounces on this one it just say pounds in the way the whole pounds or in the way the whole ounces or in the way the whole kgs or kilograms and weigh the whole kilograms Kil it, it will weigh the whole kilograms and i wanted to weigh the pounds and the ounces so i was really iffy on this but i know we was gonna have to do like our research to make sure like it was accurate so but i still have it so i, I can see how how that works but just because of that, I had went and got this. They normally use these for um, to weigh fish, but it has a pound and ounce on it. So what you would do is you would get something like a blanket, or this is a swallow blanket. I got this from my Amazon, um, the baby welcome box. Um, I just did a video on that, but yeah, something like this where you can like tie it on here somehow, like with a string. And you know, have the baby hanging inside of here with this, you know, on the hook. Somehow we'll figure it out. And then, you know, you hold it up like this so you can get the exact pounds and um, ounces on here. So I feel better with this thing. And I saw reviews and some people said like it works really good. This thing is, is accurate. And then you just need like a measuring tape. I have that too, but I don't, it's packed up the box okay so and i also have this little plastic bow i'm just going to use just this for as soon as he come out put the placenta right in here and then i'm gonna clean it and then i'm gonna get i'm gonna put some little wee wee pads we just training pads this is for dogs obviously it's a little puppy on there but um i have to get the other kind too but this was just for the placenta to put the placenta in it and um, after I clean it and then um, you know we put the salt and stuff on it on the placenta to, you know so it can dry out quicker or whatever so that's for what this was but I'm not gonna be using this after I clean it and stuff and put the the um this training pad thingy this this pad with on the with the placenta it's all salted up and herbs and stuff on it then I'm gonna use this basket I'm gonna put it in this basket so we can walk around with this for two three four days however long it takes for the placenta to the cord to fall off and so that's what I'm gonna use that basket for my sister was supposed to make me one but she haven't said anything so I'm not gonna wait you know I'm just gonna have stuff just in case and then hopefully this is a good one it is really like tough or whatever but obviously um i guess you won't know until you use it right but when he comes out i have to get all that yucky stuff out his mouth and his nose and stuff so that's why i have this and then this is for his little bath so i'm going to use this put this in the in the sink you know get all that stuff off of him he can be nice and comfortable and 
that's what I have so far that's right here I still um, I'm still waiting on the temperature the thermometer um, to check the water make sure it's warm enough they say it has to be um, like 92 degrees 94 degrees that's how hot the water is supposed to be and because um, if it's cold if I'm not cold but if it's warmer then um, the baby could possibly breathe on the water but if it's my tent you know what I'm saying it's you know, it has to be warm enough and the baby still won't breathe. He won't try to breathe underwater while he's coming out, you know, so. And then I have to get um, something. No, I was going to use a cover to put in the bathroom, like on the floor, just in case if I want to get out the tub and um, d just deliver him like on the floor or whatever. Because um, I don't know how that's going to go, like what I feel more comfortable with doing, you know. But, um, cause we was gonna get the pool, but we just gonna just do it in the tub. We don't have to get all the extra stuff. And then I have, um, this, um, for postpartum, like after you have the baby, you can sit, um, you can get in the tub with a lot of herbs and it's like a herb, herbal tea for baths, pretty bath. And, you know, it's supposed to help your vagina, you know what I'm saying, after you don't push the baby out, it's supposed to help that, make sure, you know, like, if you had any tearing or anything, it's, it's supposed to help, okay, so, that's coming too, and, what else is coming, um, I think that's about it, honestly, I probably, if I forgot something, I might just put it in the description, everything, but um, let me know what you guys think I should. Because this is my first time having the baby at home. And if you guys have done it before, let me know what you think that it was a must-have that you needed, like 100%. That you needed and you, or, or that you realized you needed and he, that you didn't have. Help a sister out, okay? Because so far, I'm just going to be using this stuff that I have right here. And I know he'll be fine, you know, he'll be fine. Um, but if it's something else that you guys think will help me out even better, just let me know. Just look out for me, girl. Look out for me. Or just, just look out for me. So, yeah, that's all I have so far. And I'm really excited, really anxious. Um, can't wait till the baby come. And that's it for this video y'all thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it make sure you like comment and subscribe and until next time peace